All right, what we're going to do now is I have um, an exercise which will give you a, a very, uh, uh, a very uh, precise understanding of what happens when you use those eight, uh, HSL sliders. Let's take a look. So here I am in Lightroom, let's move this over. And you'll see that I've clicked on this document called Colors. And once again, we're down in the HSL slider and we're under Hue. We're under HSL and we're under Hue. And you'll see that I have a color band for each of the colors listed in the HSL slider. So what happens when, I, when I'm modifying the color? So I grab that red and drag it all the way over to the left, you'll see what happens to the red. It turns pink, and it's close to magenta, but not quite. If I drag it all the way to the other end, what happens? I'm pushing the color of red into the spectrum of orange. When I drag it all the way to one end and, and pink into the other, or magenta, orange, same thing, I drag it over to the left, now I push the color red into the spectrum. I push the color orange in the spectrum of red. If I drag it all the way to the other end, I've pushed the color orange almost into the spectrum of yellow. So that's what's happening when you use that HSL slider. Yellow, drag that all the way to the end. And then if I drag it all the way to the other end, it, I, it, I jump into green. I'm going to double click to reset. So this really helps you drag all green all the way to the end it becomes yellow drag all the way to the over uh, uh, to the other end it's not quite aqua but it's very close and that's basically a very good understanding of what that hsl slider does how it pushes a color into the spectrum of another color